this is Dr. Drew Hall with Upper Cervical Healthcare of Los Angeles and Carson. Uh, today what we want to talk about, we want to kind of expand upon our pediatric uh, video that we made a few weeks ago. Uh, since the making of that video, I've had two kids in. One of them was three months old who suffered with chronic uh, colic. And it's not just the three-year-old or the three-month-old that was suffering with colic, it was the mom who had to be up all night long because of the severe reflux uh, that was happening and causing the child to wake up crying 20 times a night. And then another case uh, we had recently was a seven-year-old boy who suffered with chronic uh, vertigo all day long, felt like he was on a boat. And uh, the reason I want to talk about pediatrics today, there's a general notion uh, in our society. Well, they're kids. Kids don't have health problems. Right? We're generally taught that oh, you don't need to go to the doctor until you're 40 and you have five years of chronic degenerative health problems. Um, but believe it or not, kids, uh, lots of kids, have all sorts of um, chronic problems that they deal with and many times they aren't very good at voicing uh, their problems with their parents. I'm often reminded of this in consultation when I have an eight-year-old that comes in for whatever condition and I'm asking the child directly about their sleep habits, uh, do, you, do you have trouble falling asleep at night, and oh yeah, I stare at the ceiling for two hours, and you know, it's the first time the parent has ever um, heard it. And we also tend to discount uh, things that kids say. So if you're a parent, listen to your kid. Um, just because they're seven years old doesn't mean that they can't have health problems. Now what we do in our Los Angeles um, offices, we practice a technique called Blair Upper Cervical Chiropractic. Um, it's focused solely on the upper vertebra and the neck and their relationship uh, to the spinal cord. Now, the reason this area is so important um, is it's a very vulnerable junction to, to injury. Now, speaking of kids, like this three-month-old that we had come in, the delivery process inherently is very stressful on the neck. Sometimes they need to use forceps and vacuum extractions because the kid gets stuck in the birth canal. And then as a kid develops, there's milestones where injury can happen, such as when they roll over and mom and dad aren't paying attention, they roll over off the diaping changer rack and land on their head, or a kid that learns to walk falls down on average, this is a true statistic, 2,500 times when they're learning uh, to walk. So, and then beyond that, there's bike accidents and falling out of tree forts and things of that nature. But just because a kid is three months old or two years old or 10 years old, if they have a trauma just like an adult, their top vertebra in the neck can misalign and lock and cause a whole host of problems uh, because central nervous system in the upper neck is basically what controls everything. So getting back to this uh, six-year-old who had chronic vertigo, it's been two weeks and it's 90% gone. The kid's driving an hour and a half to the office. Uh, I wish there was someone closer that did the work we do, otherwise i refer them, but there isn't. Um, but interesting fact with him, uh, about 10 days in to care, I think it was his second visit, the mom says, you know, another really interesting thing happened. Uh, since you've adjusted him, we just thought that he had slow bowels. He was only having two bowel movements uh, a week. And since he's been corrected, he's been having a bowel movement every day. Now, to some of you listening, that might sound like, what's this guy talking about? Adjusting the neck in the GI tract? Well, central nervous system, again, controls all the function in your body. So this doesn't mean that an upper neck misalignment is the cause of everything, but because everything that the brain tells the rest of the body to do runs through that top vertebra, if it's misaligned under the skull, it can indeed affect any part of the body and cause any type of problem. And in this boy's case, it wasn't just his vertigo and unsteadiness and imbalance that he had chronically every day. It was a backed up GI tract. And then uh, the little girl, three month old, that was up all night. And this is the great thing about kids. Because the problem generally hasn't been there for two or three or four decades, like lots of the adults that we see, um, kids respond really quickly because they're quick healers. And when they have an upper neck problem that hasn't been there a long time to cause a prolonged pattern of damage in the system. And so the three month old, which if you want to go read the testimony, it's on our Yelp page under Upper Cervical Chiropractic, Dr. Drew Hall, Los Angeles. Uh, the mom wrote a Yelp review 
uh, what happened to her kid, her three month old, but we got her adjusted and she's sleeping basically straight through the night now. There's no colic problem. So generally when young kids are crying all the time, it's either they have to go to the bathroom or they're hungry. But if it's more than that, there's something going on that you as a parent should pay attention to. And many times it's this upper neck area. So those are just a couple of two stories on pediatric upper cervical chiropractic here in Los Angeles. Uh, if you're listening and you have kids who are dealing with chronic problems, um, whether it be vertigo or constipation, sleep problems, uh, ADD, any of these types of problems uh, we commonly see in our office. We have an office in Los Angeles uh, where we commonly see patients from Westwood, Beverly Hills, Burbank, the Los Angeles proper area, Hollywood, Glendale, and all the surrounding areas. And then we have another office in uh, Carson, uh, Tor and that office serves Torrance, Manhattan Beach, Redondo Beach, Hermosa, Rancho Palos Verdes, Cerritos, Long Beach, um, San Pedro, and all of those surrounding areas. Now, if you're outside of the Los Angeles area and you need an upper cervical chiropractor near me or you, um, be, uh, we'd be happy to find you one. All you have to do is call our office. Our LA office is 213-399-7772. And if you need a Blair Upper Cervical Chiropractor near you, we'd be happy to find you one. Just give us a ring. I uh, hope this video was um, informative and uh, someone who's suffering, it gives them information maybe they've been looking for and you get into an Upper Cervical Chiropractor's office and uh, it can change your life. Thank you. Thank you.